What is up everybody? We are here with the biggest games releasing this month for the month of March, the series where we highlight all of the games releasing this month. Shout out to last month's winner, Charlene Styles. If you want a chance to win a game this month, all you have to do is be following us on TikTok, leave a like, and then please, I'm begging you, tell me what video game you want to win and why. Anyway, coming into March, starting off hot, we have King of the Castle, King of the Castle. Steve, edit that out. Uh, King of the Castle coming to PC March 3rd. The hotly anticipated Wulong Fallen Dynasty is coming to all consoles. Little transparency, I am currently reviewing this game on PC. It has some major issues on Steam. It's on Game Pass and it's perfectly playable on all consoles. So I would say maybe wait for a patch or play it on a console. Otherwise, the game is pretty good. March 7th, Little Witch No Better hits PS4 and Switch. Paranormasite, The Severn Mysteries of Hanjo comes to PC and Switch. Fatal Frame, Mask of the Lunar Eclipse hits all consoles and PC. Transport Fever 2 comes to all consoles and Train Life Baby. A railway simulator launches on Switch. Finally, on the 9th, Session, an incredible skate sim, is making its way to Switch. March 14th, The Legend of Heroes Trails of Azure comes to PS4, Switch, and PC. On March 16th, we have Anno 1800 making its way to PS5 and current Xbox consoles. And then the Dark Pictures Switchback VR, which I didn't know existed, is launching on PSVR 2. On March 17th, Bayonetta Origins, Cereza and the Lost Demon, huh? Comes to Switch. WWE 2K23 is launching on all major platforms and PC, and only time will tell if this is gonna be another messy, broken, buggy, unplayable mess. March 21st, Deceive Inc. is hitting all current gen consoles and PC. Remnant from the Ashes, one of my favorite games to come out in the past few years, finally making its way to Switch, and I cannot wait for Remnant 2. Ch -ch 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 Chia is also coming out on the 21st on PS consoles and PC, and maybe bleep that out because we could get demonetized. I don't know about TikTok, but YouTube maybe. March 22nd, Have a Nice Death, will do, hits Switch and PC. March 24th, Resident Evil 4 Remake is hitting current gen consoles and PC, and oh my god, if this game is just RE2 Remake, but in Resident Evil 4, we are in for one hell of a game this year. Honestly, probably gonna be a game of the year contender, most likely. Atelier Riza 3, Alchemist of the End, and The Secret Key. <sighs> Launches on Switch. EA Sports PGA Tour hits all current gen consoles and PC. On March 28th, we have Crime Boss. Boss Baby. Boss Baby 2. Rock A City hitting PC. The Last of Us Part 1 is making its way to PC, and this is one of my favorite games of all time. It is well worth playing, especially after the show being so great. Also on the 28th, MLB The Show 23 is launching on all major platforms except PC. And to round out the month on the 30th, Nor9. Norn, the number nine, VAR Commons launches on Switch. The Great War Western Front hits PC, and finally, The Last Worker hits every console and PC. So, listen to me, listen to me, right now. I'm grabbing you by the ears, listen to me. If you want a chance to win a game this month for March 2023, all you have to do is be following us on TikTok. Follow us on TikTok, come on, do it. Like this video, I'm begging you, like this video. And then tell us in the comments what video game you wanna win and why, cause I wanna know, I need to know, okay? And you could win, I believe in you. Well, we'll see you next month, baby. Mwah. Mwah.